it's right here um, and actually uh, if you notice on here I've kind of marked out a line on here that's offset at an angle and what it's as the layer is gone it's going to repeat now the tough part is I have to cut um, these on that angle to get that square that's going to so it's going to kind of spiral as it goes out uh, this is going to be tough I'm using the cross cut sled for this because of how I got to cut them and I'm going to have to shim them on the side to try to get them uh, to cut as close to that line as possible so I can repeat the square. We'll see how it works out.
hope you enjoyed this video. My goal in this video was just to give everybody kind of an idea of some of the work uh, that goes into making some of these cutting boards. Now this one was a little bit more complex as far as the, the length of the process goes and the number of cuts and the amount of waste that was generated during the whole process. Uh, this one I think in my free time over about a week and a half I made these two. Um, I can't take credit for some of the patterns that I do, actually most of them. Uh, most of them I learned just by watching YouTube videos and uh, looking at uh, some other folks' website. I want to big, give big credit to MTM Wood. Uh, most of his videos, uh, great channel, check it out. Uh, I learned a lot of the stuff I've, I've learned how to do over the past couple years by watching his channel. Um, really amazing stuff that that, uh, that guy creates. You know, I, I can't thank him enough for actually inspiring me to get into this. Um, but you probably can't see in the camera, I've got a massive mess to clean up in here from this project. Hope you enjoyed it and see you later.